Hi everyone, Michael here again. I converted my bow slingshot into a double bow that will shoot arrows. Um, my two bows are a little warped, so I'm going to be shooting from down lower. If you had two straight bows, you could probably convert the handle into an arrow rest to hold your arrows to shoot perfectly. But since this is so warped, I'm just going to be using the notch where the two joints make. Um, if you make one of these, like, a lot of people will probably think it's crap. And that's alright, that's their opinion. This is something to do in a survival situation. You happen to make two weak bows, then it's, then it's functional. Convert your two weak bows into something more powerful. Um, so it's well worth doing. I'm not an actor, so I don't practice much. Sometimes I gotta get some good bows, but see how I do. I'm gonna Arrows aren't long enough for me. But that's not bad. That's pretty powerful. I can hunt squirrels or a rabbit. A little bit more powerful. Could probably get there. Just shooting out a box full of clothes. <laughs> it stinks I can't draw back all the way all the way since the arrows are too short for me. These are only like twenty eight inch arrows. Homemade. I need thirty two inch arrows. That's not bad. Got <laughs> I got every one. So making a double bow like this. The survival situation is a pretty good thing to do. If and it works out great because if your two arrows are warped, then you can use somewhere on the side. So I just used the notch here. If you had two well-made bows, like I said, you could create a create an arrow rest in the center. Um, there's also the other way of tying two bows together. Maybe I'll do that in that take this all apart and tie two bows together so that they, they're right near each other but they're pretty warped so I don't know if it'll work. This works great especially when you have two warped bows, bows. I'm surprised I actually got that somewhat high power distance it's probably like 30, 30, 40 feet so that isn't too bad Great for getting squirrels or rabbits. Right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that video. Enjoyed this video. Take it easy. Bye.
tree is definitely a hot, lot harder and they bounced off but you could hear they hit pretty hard they even marked up the tree pretty good so I know they hit hard and they'd have no problems getting squirrels or rabbits and with broad heads they'd be even better thanks for watching